Good evening and welcome back to Cricket Captain 2023 and we are starting today with the One Day Cup. Here we go. Here we go. So the One Day Cup is a little bit weird in um, English domestic cricket because it runs alongside the 100, which basically means that a lot of the counties use the One Day Cup as a chance to expose younger players to a higher level of cricket um, and also use players who are coming back from injury. Um, keep experienced players in the squad, of course, because you need some experience and stuff like that. So it's kind of um, it's kind of like a it's not a secondary cup like you want to win the cup, but it is almost a little bit less than the blast and definitely below the hundred because the hundred is paying more. So the best players usually tend to play in the hundred. But for us, it is a chance to test out a lot of our second team, a lot of our team that aren't playing in the hundred. And see how the players can do. So let's go. First game. We've, and look at that. We've got a lot of players who aren't in the 100. Um, and who are, I should say. Both, really. There's a bit of both. Um, so. Hook is playing in the 100. So we'll swap him out. So is Walter. So Richards can come in. Um, Wokesy as well. Rossington, so we do need a keeper, so I guess Bottleman can go there and open. Wow. Um, Ryan will definitely plays because he was playing in the blast. And there's Lawrence. Okay, so we've actually got four openers here. That is pretty crazy. Um, five bowlers, but we've got three spinners and not a lot of pace in there. Snater definitely comes in for Richards, I'm going to say. Palmer goes up. Uh, Porter is first bowler. Snater second bowler. Yeah, that's okay. Um, English could get a chance, I suppose. Um, actually, no. Richards is going to play instead of... Oh, no. The wrong one. Instead of Benkenstein. Um, yeah. Bottleman's average is not great. Mm, yeah. Okay, but there we go. So we've actually got a lot of youth, kind of younger players, giving it a go here. For example, we've got William Gates, who's played a little bit last year, but not a lot. Um, Richards, same again. I don't think played much at all. If we look at last year, didn't actually play him at all last year. And then this year, he played one game. Yeah, he played one game for me in the county championship so far. Um, everyone else has kind of had a good amount of cricket. Take a look at Rymel. Um, last year, nothing. Uh, this year. Has played, yeah, played 20, played 11 matches in the T20. And I think he did all right. You know, he didn't do so bad. Butterman, I don't know how much Butterman has played this year. Played a decent amount last year. Played in the One Day Cup and also played a few first class matches. He has played two this year as well. Um, But yeah, that's okay. Sam's doesn't play one day as anyway, so that's all right. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We've got our team. It's a bit of a, like, a, well, not a weaker team, but it's a bit of a youngsters team a bit. Look at that. We've got a debutant there. They're playing three openers. I'm playing four with a keeper in there. It's a, it's a keeper bowler, or is it just keeper? I can't quite tell. Anyway, we're going to bowl. <laughs> we're going to bowl. And try our best. It's 50 overs, so obviously a run of ball would put you at 300 runs. So anywhere about 300 um, is good if you're the batting side. If you're the bowling side, you want to maybe try and keep them under 250. Pace bowling front foot offside. Okay, so we're going to target those stumps. Play a bit of a very aggressive. Play a bit of a body line kind of situation here. See if we can catch them out. 
round the corners. Let's give that a go. We'll go to low chances and play the over. Six off the first. And lower that. And we're still going to, yeah, we're still going to go for the body line and see what we can get. Nothing yet. Um, although, like, the ball is, if the ball is swinging, you want to throw in the odd ball ball. But they are doing that anyway, so that's okay. Here we go, Porter to Yates. That's pretty full. That's what I'm talking about, throwing in the full delivery. But that's not been given out. Wow, 10 off that over. The economies are a little bit high. Just to start this game off. Snater to Yates. Oh, he's gone away with that one. Yeah, and they're going at sixes. So they're going at, you know, they're expecting 300 here. So let's, let's actually change it up. Kind of bowl a regular line now. Because it obviously wasn't working trying to... Oh, that's in the air. And it's taken. There we go. The regular line worked straight away. Trying to uh, bounce them out just wasn't working, obviously. And back foot offside. Okay, so we can bowl full and we can target those stumps. That's fine. Snater to Yates. Yates is gone. LBW playing the wrong line. Yeah, that's fine. That's good. Okay, now I feel like. Having got through the openers, really slowed down the run rate. We're in a better spot now. Um, let's change it up. Bring on Richards. Went for eight runs. Snater to Rhodes. That's gone as well. Snater Rhodes gets a... Oh, a duck. Not great. Not great. Look at that. So weird. A left-hand bat, right-hand fast medium. Opens the batting, but can bowl. Incredible stuff. Incredible stuff. Pace back foot, leg side. Okay, so front foot, offside, average aggression. Okay, this is, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm really, I think we're in a good place here. Let's keep it going. Richards can have another over, maybe a wicket. Ooh, nothing there, but a really tidy over. Only one run from it, and it was off the last ball. So, yeah, bowling that regular line has really uh, changed. Change things up. We've really tightened things up. Trying to bounce them out at the start was maybe the wrong tactic there. But, you know, that's fine. That's fine. You've got to kind of, uh, got to kind of learn these things as we go. Going across. Yeah, slowed them all the way down to 4.8 here. Snater's probably got to change now. He's bowled eight overs. Um... Yeah, let's bring let's bring the spin on. Bring the spin on of Will Gates. Richards to Barnard. It's in the air. That's dropped by Bottleman. That's frustrating. And we'll bring uh, no, we'll bring Porter back. Gates to Barnard. We're gonna try and get spin going on one end and kind of rotate the bowlers on the other end. Stumped in. Bottleman makes up for it. Very aggressive, okay. Very aggressive. Yeah, and does smack a four off only his third delivery. Um, Porter's going to have another over. Gates to Nicholson. Here we go, the aggressive batsman. Can we get rid of him early? Yeah, we can. Bold him. Gates, incredible stuff. Finish up the over. Spin bowling back foot offside. All right. We've now got a batsman at the crease who prefers spin bowling. So let's all let's give Rymel an over. I've only got. No, I mean, I've got five bowlers. Do I need to actually not? I'm going to give it a go. Oh, six, four. Yeah, OK, he's going for a few too many runs here, Rymel. Economy of seven. So let's bring on Simon Harmer. Great gates to Granville. That's out. That's LBW. He did make a 50, though. Good on him. That has an alley. Yeah, it is. Wow. He's playing in the one day, not in the... Very aggressive. Wow. 
Okay, that's okay. Palmer's going okay. Palmer to Maddie. That's straight. Oh, that stumped him again. Bottomman with another stumping. They're getting themselves out. They are getting themselves out right now. And let's let Gates finish up. Now back to the pace. Snater can finish up as well. Armour to Ali. 198 for 7. Like we're doing okay here. That's, oh my word, it's another drop. Bottomman's got quick hands with the stumpings, but not, not able to take the catches right now. But Harmer does it himself anyway. Pace ball in front for the leg side. Okay, Snater's going to finish up. And what is Snater and Gates finished up? 3 for 47, Snater 2 for 45. Good performances there. Really good performances there. I'm happy with that. Alma to Boyce now. Oh, no edge, I don't believe. But next ball is another chance. Oh, again, no edge, but Snater, yeah, Snater's bowled out, that's fine. Let's bring back Porter and see if we can finish these last two wickets before I need to go back to Jamal Richards. Oh, no. Okay, no play lost. That's good. Porter to Johal, the pace bowling. Yeah, there we go. That's a grab. That's an incredible grab. Porter to Simmons. And the same again. That's out. There we go. That's the innings. Two, two, six. All out and bringing Porter back did work. <laughs> Gets the last two wickets in quick, quick fashion there. A great catch and then uh, the number 11 out for a duck, unfortunately. But not the only duck. Will Rhodes also got a duck. So we're chasing a relatively lower score. And I'm actually going to give Bottleman and Rymel the chance here. Going to give them the chance to open the batting in a uh, in a one-day cup county level game against some good bowlers. Hassan Ali there, the good bowler, very defensive and then defensive as well. Ali to Rymel. There we go. Nick Brown comes in. Rymel, I gave you a chance to open and. Didn't really do much with it, I'm afraid. One for one. One for one on the deal. Well, the Duckworth Lewis is our score at 19 already because we lost that wicket. Ali to Brown. It's in the air. And it's taken. Brown has done it as well. So, yeah, maybe it's just a difficult pitch to bat on. Let's kind of chill out here, try and calm it down and get some runs here. Get a partnership going, get some batters set. Oh, my word. Oh. Turning it on to run, so I'm not terrified of every highlight now. <laughs> Simmons to Cookie. There we go. Cookie kind of settling in a little bit there. Ali to Cook. Oh, that's in the air, but is there a fielder out there? There is, and Cook has done it as well. Just the top order absolutely capitulating. It must be difficult to bat, but still, still, that's just not good from experienced players as well as youth youngsters. That's a much better shot. That, I mean, Tom Westy's come out and said, all right, I'll do it myself. Simmons to Wesley. Yeah, that's a great shot. Okay. Power play's ended. Bottleman's actually, like, he's batting very slow, but he's still there. And if he could get settled, if he could get settled, you never know. He could actually kind of take off. Great shot from Wesley. Wesley again now. Again, great shot. Four runs. And we're still well behind the rate. But we only need fours and overs, so like we're win we oh wow, Wesley getting turned into an S there. And I'm just kind of hoping the bottleman can stay there. All you have to do is stay there. We're forty six for five. We are actually we are actually kind of 
flopping this ourselves. Top order bat, just not not doing it. We only need fives. We need a boundary and over. And if you can't get a boundary and over. Oh my word. Oh my word. This is this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy kind of just absolute collapse here. Top order collapse. And it's kind of bleeding into the middle order as well. Oh, how's that not out? I, I really would have thought that was out. Okay. Chop. Okay. This is better. A little bit better. We had a, a 30 partnership and then another flurry of wickets. Now we've had a basically a 20 run partnership. But we're so low down that the chances of players getting out now is kind of higher, obviously. Das is settled. And Das can bat. He is a batsman. Armour, a bowler who also can bat. We need fives and over now. And it's kind of creeping up on us. We're at the halfway mark at 85. We need 142 for the next 25 overs. And then Das re reverse. Oh. Goes for the reverse sweep. Run rate is now up to six. Shot. That's a good shot. That's just straight up a good shot. That's not out. I'm afraid that cannot be out. That's a better delivery, but that's a good shot again. It's at six and over now. We've literally got 126 runs from 126 balls. Hummer is settled. Kind of would need Nater to go with him here. Provided Hummer doesn't do anything silly. I mean, there we go. 5.8. It's come down a bit, but we just don't have the wickets here to play risky cricket. That's a 4. Again, 5.8. That's okay. That's That's got to go. And it has. Yeah, that had to go. That was a terrible uh, bit of bowling. And then responds with a full delivery. And there we go. Okay. Harmer's on his own now. A little bit. Nothing there. Fine. That's a great shot from Gates. That's put away a bad ball, and that really does help. We still need 100 runs here. Two wickets in the bank. Harmer is settled. Gates is probably... Well, okay, that's a good shot. I was going to say Gates is probably... I'm a bit more worried about. He might. He's more likely to get out. But if Harmer does get out, I think that might be it. That's a six, is it? That's a four. Okay, fine, but good shot. That's a great shot as well. No, that's in the air. Oh my word, it's safe. Somehow. That's safe somehow. Armour is now just settled. Okay, that's a good over. That's a good over. Armour is, is completely settled. Hopefully now can keep playing his shot. 70 runs needed. They all got those two wickets in hand. This is... I mean, if, if Gates can keep it up and Harmer can keep hitting, there is still a chance here. He's playing so well. Harmer is playing so well. No! Bowled by a straight one. And now it does come down. To the number 10 and the number 11 to try their best to get something from this game. And then Porter gets bowled for a duck. There we go. <laughs> well, you can't really blame 
the bat the the lower order here. Uh, you've got to play in the top order. Two ducks, uh, seven and eleven, and then from here onwards, you kind of say that's a regular innings. You know, you got twenty six or twenty one, one failure there from Richards Palmer with a a lower order smack, and then some good contributions, and unfortunately, a number eleven does get out for nothing, but. Top order is where we struggled today. And we lose by 60 runs after what I thought was a pretty good um, bowling performance to keep to keep uh, our opposition down to just, well, 200. That's pretty good. That's pretty, I've got to say, that's pretty good, you know. But Warwickshire, they did have too much in the end. And the next game is a 100 game. Um, Oh, no, it's the next day. So let's take a look at the tables again. We're looking at the 50 overs. We're in Group B. We're down in eight. But, of course, we've only played one game. And, uh, oh, look, there's no result in there already. Kind of messing things up. And I'm actually taking a bit of confidence from our bowling performance in that game, even though we didn't win the game. Um, the batting performance, a little bit less. I probably have to go back to Brown and Cook as the openers. Um... Because if the youngsters, if the youth player openers do get out cheaply, then Brown and Cook are basically opening anyway, except you've lost two wickets. And yeah, it's not great. Anyway, let's look at the 100. Well, we've only played one. We got a win. And it looks like the Southern Brave beat the Welsh Fire in their second games. But we're still fine. We're, we're sitting pretty in the 100. So that's hopefully where we'll continue off next time thank you very much for watching guys i do i do hope you enjoy the cricket videos i really enjoy making them they're quite easy to record they're quite chill i'm just playing a relatively simple game with not a lot of actual like um focused gameplay like i am focused on the game but i can kind of sit i can talk i can take things at my own pace and i really enjoy that so there we go thank you very much for watching guys and i shall catch you next time